game emulation on the Steam Deck is wrong. It feels so good. And that's why you need to see this guy on Reddit who made the ultimate, ultimate 3DS emulator on the Steam Deck with the help of an extra little accessory. I can't wait to show you it. It looks absolutely amazing. Anyways, guys, I'm Blaze2K. Okay. Please like, smash the subscribe, and click the bell icon for more Steam Deck content. Let's get into it. So guys, welcome back to another video. As you know, I love the Steam Deck, and I've done a bunch of Steam Deck content. Go check out the channel if you want to see more. Um, but yeah, as you know, the Steam Deck can emulate just about any system, even up to <coughs> Nintendo Switch and a lot of big Nintendo consoles. NES, Super Nintendo, Genesis, Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, Nintendo 64, GameCube, PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3 in some cases. Um... I don't think there's anything this thing can't emulate. Um, and the greatest big new emulator is obviously 3DS. And look at the look at what this guy did to make his 3DS emulation experience next level. Let's get into it. So this article comes courtesy of Nintendo Life Random. Reddit user creates the ultimate 3DS emulator with a Steam Deck. Bigger is better, after all, they say. Um, the Steam Deck is widely known for its remarkable, remarkable emulation capabilities, with users reporting um, most recently managing to emulate, um, enable gyro controls for Wii U emulation. It's not entirely surprising when you consider that the Steam Deck is effectively a portable PC, but it's still impressive nonetheless. Now, one Reddit user has taken things to the next level by creating what is essentially a 3DS on steroids. In a video posted on the Steam Deck subreddit, user Rising Tony demonstrates how they have loosely modded the Steam Deck by clipping on an additional screen to allow for a fully authentic 3DS emulation. Now, wait till you see this, guys. Wait till you see this. It's insane. So, here it is here. Look at this. Look at this, for goodness sake. He's clipped on what looks like a tablet up here with maybe like a display out or a little portable mini screen. He's using some sort of maybe 3D printed or using some sort of like um, tablet stand thing that clips onto the bottom of the Steam Deck. And he's got the two screens, um, the top and the bottom 3DS screen on there. And it looks absolutely insane. Um, now, Steam Deck... It just gets better and better. It honestly does. I mean, I've never seen a console come out that supports so many other consoles via emulation. Um, I think we're like people are running up to PS3 games on this thing now. And look at that; it even supports gyro controls. Um, so I don't know if you. I mean, you could obviously play 3DS on this without a second screen. I mean, they're just, you're just going to have the screen side by side. Maybe a larger screen for the top screen of the 3DS, and then a smaller touch screen. Um, for the bottom screen, but seeing it like this, dude, it does look like a 3DS and steroids, and, you know, things like this are, game, video game preservation like this is important for the gaming industry, because as you know, Nintendo have basically abandoned the 3DS, um, they're no longer supporting it, they're no longer keeping their servers online for it, you're basically on your own, if you own a 3DS, you're basically on your own, almost, pretty much, um, in terms of buying new content for it. So, it's good that emulation exists. Um, obviously, I recommend buying your games legitimately. Um, but, you know, if you can't buy your games legally, then wh what are you supposed to do? You know? Um, so, <laughs> um, this looks awesome, doesn't it? I want to try this out so bad. I need to find out what screen, what screen he's got. But, um, back to the article. Um, so, he says, as you can see in the video demonstration, the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D, the emulation allows for touchscreen support on the lower screen, as well as full, full gyro support for when you want to look around or aim with your catapult. I'd imagine this thing's a little bit heavy though, right? Perhaps more impressively, however, the addition of a second screen doesn't look horrible. It looks pretty nice. In fact, we'd definitely love to try this out. Of course, the only thing missing is the 3D effect itself, and we'd wager this would be near enough impossible for a fan to achieve. But we're more than willing to be proven wrong. Of course, Nintendo itself dropped support for 3D effects in some of its later games, so we don't think this would prove much of an issue for people looking to emulate 3DS games on the Steam Deck. What do you reckon? 3DS slash Steam Deck hybrid. Have you managed to perform any similar emulation feats you'd like to share? Let me know in the comments below on this video, as well potentially on this Nintendo Life article, which kudos to them for finding it. That looks so good. I need this in my life. I need this in my life. I cannot, like, overstate how amazing the Steam Deck is in terms of just, like, how much it's capable of in terms of emulating other systems, playing your PC games. 
<sighs> when will it end? When will this thing stop being so damn awesome? Um, <laughs> I love you. I love you, Steam Deck. Anyways, guys, I'm Blaster K. Thank you for stopping on this video. Please let me know what you think in the comments. Just say hi. And also, follow me over on Twitter. Link in the description also. Come say hi on Twitter. Let's be friends. Um, I'm trying to be a lot more active. I'm trying to be a lot more active on Twitter, and I'd love to hear hear from you over there. Okay, so click that link down there. Follow me on Twitter. Say hi, um, or don't. It's up to you. Um, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Place to King signing off. Goodbye.